Hey guys, Luke here, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about the brand new TomTom Tom Go Expert 5 inch. Now, I've been reviewing and using TomTom Tom products for years. Uh, if you go back on my channel, you'll see that I've been doing them pretty much since the start of my career. I've always used TomTom. Tom. I've always found them to be the best out there. And uh, I, quite frankly, I love them. I love the products. So I'm very happy to um, have become a brand ambassador for TomTom. Tom. And uh, I'm, I'm grateful to be able to review new products that they are releasing. I've been using a TomTom Tom Go Expert 7 inch now for nearly a year. In fact, I've done a video on it already. And uh, it's, it's massively improved uh, from the previous generation, which was the Go Professional 6250. Uh, the Go Expert has helped me out in a lot of situations and has a lot of core features on it, which I will go uh, through in a later video. But this one is just gonna be me unboxing this. Uh, and just sort of turning it on, setting it up, and giving you my thoughts on the Go Expert. But yeah, let's get it unwrapped. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, here we are, the box. By the way, apologies for seeing my legs. <laughs> um, anyway, let's get this unwrapped. Get it unwrapped, it's still in its cellophane. Ooh, it's a good feeling. There we go. Let's, uh, let's throw that over there. New TomTom Tom Go Expert, and it's the five inch, as you can see just there. Let's uh, slide it on out and see what it looks like on the inside. So, looks like we get a little uh, welcome message. Enjoy, enjoy your upgrade to the better drives. And then obviously in different languages as well. Just if you wanted to see that a bit closer. Okay. So we lift that up. So we've got a start guide. That's the first thing you see. Obviously, if you want to go through uh, through it and have a look at some of the features. So the first thing we've looked at is uh, connecting your phone to it via Bluetooth. So that's that there. We'll look at that later. And here we go, five inch. Ah, oh, it's tiny. <laughs> it's so much smaller than the seven inch, which I got on my screen. Now, apparently, Bigger is better, apparently. But they do also say good things come in small packages. And that is, is it is small. Now that's not a bad thing. Smaller means it takes up less space on your windscreen. If it takes up less space on your windscreen, you can see more outside of your, uh, of your, outside of your windscreen, therefore meaning it's more safe. So smaller can be better. Let me just show you what the seven inch looks like in comparison. <laughs> so this is the five inch. That's the seven inch. There's, there's quite a difference. Um, that's massive on your windscreen, which is good because it's easy to see, but it does take up a bit of space in the corner of the windscreen. So the five inch is basically the solution to that. Make sure uh, it takes up less space. That's, that's, that's a lot of difference. <laughs> so one of the first things I'm looking at is the connections on the back. They, it appears to be the same connector on the back. So in theory, this will connect to my existing mount. I'm gonna have a look at that now. But before I do look at the mount, let's just uh, unpack a little bit more. So uh, yeah, so inside the box you get, so that was on the top, uh, the TomTom Tom was on that. Underneath you get the mount, which does look identical to what I've already got, the cable, and also the, uh, the cigarette cable port. To plug it in to be powered okay so here we are the tom tom is now uh plugged in to the mount that it comes provided with and uh, i also tested it out on the existing mount and it does fit so that's good here's just another comparison of what they look like uh so you got the seven which i did have there and the five the seven inch the five inch, as you can see, there's quite a difference. So we're just gonna go and set this up now. It shouldn't be too hard to set up whatsoever. So we're gonna select, okay, yeah. So English United Kingdom, we are gonna be in the UK 
and we are going to be driving a truck click next uh put in our profile so just put in the height for now and we are currently 4.2 meters we're going to agree to all that uh yes 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 uh, we'll set up the phone later. We'll set up the Wi-Fi later. And there we go. Welcome to your TomTom Tom Go Expert. Now, obviously, we've not signed into our account yet, so we don't have all of our uh, POIs or anything like that. But it's uh, it's almost ready to go. We're just going to recenter it. It looks slightly different. Ever. Mm. I don't think there's a search button on the top left of the one I've got now. I think you've got to do that and then press search. Uh, so that's new. Uh, let's just try a random destination. Uh, just guessing. Somewhere up in Manchester. Uh, so sort of like M5, 4. What's going to come up? Salford, yeah, there we go. Salford Centre, it's 127 miles away. Let's see how long it takes to calculate a route. It should calculate three different routes and then ask us to pick the one that we want to take. So there's the first route. Second route is calculating. There we go. And it's going to calculate a third route as well. And there's the third route. And obviously we can swipe down and select the one we want to take. Excellent. So it does look like it's almost identical to the seven inch which has already been out for about a year we are just going to go into some settings and just see what else we got you will arrive at your destination at 7 51 p.m arrival information yeah we want both final destination brightness so yeah brightness is already on 100 percent at the moment yeah it looks it looks identical looks identical everything is exactly the same you can make this bar wider or thinner i think on the smaller one it's probably best to be um thinner whereas on the seven inch i do have it selected so it's wider if i can just show you now there we go so i've recentered it so yeah it's, it's taken up like a thicker amount of screen you can have it so it's only taken up half like it is over there but um yeah i've got it set up so it's thick on that one but yeah no it looks good um we are going to be testing it over the next sort of few days and uh, we're going to be trialing it out make sure it's all okay but i like this it's nice and small it's not too big it's not in your way it's in the corner it's pretty cool i like it so yeah that's going to be set on my windscreen now for the next few days i'm going to be testing this thing out uh it does like i said it looks almost exactly the same as the seven the only, th the only thing i've noticed different so far is at the top left hand corner there's like a search button that's the only difference i can see so far it's got the same size mount uh and it boasts all the same features as far as i'm aware but like i said i'm going to be trying it out uh there's going to be a lot of tom tom content on this channel over the next few months so if you do have any questions regarding the tom tom go expert be it the five inch the six inch which i don't actually have yet or the seven inch any comment that you may have leave it down in the comment section down below be it for the five inch the six inch that i don't actually have yet or the seven inch leave a comment i will read it and i will answer it in an upcoming video because i do have a q a video coming up about the seven inch and also some top features i like about the seven inch as well but yeah the five inch it's a new new uh product released from tom tom so i'm aware it's brand new just released and uh yeah if you are interested click the link down below go and buy yourself one i've got a discount code on the six inch i believe um so yeah check it out link in the description down below